To see the full effect of some of these projects, you really have to have the lights off to get the effect of the lighting. Many of them use shadowing as part of the, the art. This is the galaxy. This one that does a really good example of the shadowing. Let me turn a little light out in the back. Um, you can see the holes and the lights are inside and it creates constellations on there. And then lighting up our football field and our um, baseball fields at night is very important. And this, she titled it Electric Art, and as you can see, there's kind of a rose made out of the art, out of the lighting on the art easel. Here's our collages with their lighting. You can see the great shadowing that takes place with the the paper mache lights there. You see the shadowing that she uses in the window of the tree house. She actually bound all of those sticks together that she found on the side of the road. Her mom said, oh, look at all these sticks on the side of the road. And we picked them up and she used it in her project. You get the full effect of those Christmas trees once the light are, lights are on. Here's the shadowing from below that looks like the water and then the coral on top. And the lights that are even back shadowing the trees at night. 